சிவாயனமே திருச்சிற்றம்பலம் வெல்கம் பேக் டு அவர் டிஸ்கஷன் ஆன் சொக்கநாத வெண்பா வேர்ஸ் நம்பர் நைன்டீன் த வேர்ஸ் கோஸ் திஸ் வே ஆர் வந்தன் ஆர் போயன் ஐயா உன் ஆனந்த சீர் உளத்தே என்றும் செறிந்திலதேல் காரிருண்ட கண்டனே ஓர் குருடன் காதல் கொண்டாள் போல் மதுரை ஆண்டனே சொக்கநாத Today's verse is something that we have to read again and again and internalize the meaning and always stay put in that particular concept. What is today's verse? He talks about ar vandu en. Whoever comes into my life, I'm not I should not be bothered about it. Whoever whoever walks out of my life, that that should also not disturb me. If you look at it today we are all getting disturbed by these two either someone comes into our life or someone is walking away from our life but interestingly we can observe when someone walks into our life sometimes we are happy or sometimes when someone walks into our life we are sad alternatively the other way also stands good when someone walks away from us we feel happy when someone walks away from us we feel sad if you analyze it is it really a happiness or is it really a sadness that depends on someone obviously no those of us who are learning saiva siddhantam we know this is not the reality either we are giving pain to someone or someone else is giving pain to us either we are giving happiness to someone and they are giving happiness to us but if you analyze it in a deeper manner in a in a human form we can't give happiness or we can't give sorrow to someone else instead it should all be dependent on lord shiva now if we have to understand this concept better you have to look at the second phrase here karirul kandane we all know lord shiva has a beautiful lord shiva's color is so beautiful he is a uh, red reddish in color not really red but you know the the early morning uh, kind of an orangish color lord shiva's color is that that's what most of our uh, arulalargal have uh, been saying that in that he has a throat which is black in color because of the poison that he drank the blue color stay, stays in his throat and when we see lord shiva it, that's more obvious when we see him that's more obvious very 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 clearly seen very vivid that's why karpana kalanjiyam siva prakasar in sona saila male he would say you know when we have a tattoo all of us know what happens with a tattoo two or three years then the color will diminish a little bit so we'll have to go and top up right so all of us have, have been doing this whoever has our uh, the the shiva logo we will usually have that now when we top up our tattoo we we will make it a little bit brighter now kapte kal jm siva prakasar used to say lord shiva your throat the the darkness in your throat has diminished that is to show that it has already you know it's it's quite old now do you want to take my arnavam as that because that's a poison you want to take my arnavam and put it in your throat so that the brightness or the color will be even more brighter or it will be more darker or thicker even though that is given in a very fun oriented manner but there's a lot of serious thoughts in it if we analyze what goes into lord shiva's throat what is the reason as in what is the poison it is basically our arnava now relate this with the first line when someone comes into our life or walks into our life we are going through the feeling of sorrow or joy both are caused because of arnava when someone leaves us we are crying we are feeling sad for it which means our arnavam is there when someone comes into our life we are so happy we are like a jumping jack which also means that our arnavam is proceeding over there but what we have to do is stay neutral surrender to lord shiva because he is the only one who can give us happiness he is the only one who can give us sorrow obviously he will never give it give it If you look at people around us they will always try to give some kind of a pain but Lord Shiva will never 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 do that he can only give happiness and the real happiness is from him so what we have to do surrender ourselves completely to Lord Shiva and say whoever walks into my life i welcome there them whoever goes out of my life i bid farewell without 
any disturbance in my soul because the soul is not going to be disturbed by someone who's going to be external who's also a, another soul rather i'm going to surrender myself to lord shiva because the real happiness is going to be given only by lord shiva that's what verse number 19 is all about i'll come back again with the next verse very soon until then sivaya namaskar chitrambala